Right. Who wants to try and guess what my favorite food is? What do you think? What's my favorite food? It's not burritos. I really love burritos, but that's not it. What's my favorite? What do you think my favorite food is? It's not tacos. Oh, somebody said it. What is it? Say it again. It's pizza. How many of you guys like pizza? You like it? I like pizza so much. I, I wrote a song about pizza. I like, I like peanut butter. You did? I like pizza. Well, I like pizza so much. I wrote a song about pizza. My song is called Everybody Likes Pizza. And I like my song so much, I put it on a CD. My CD is called Everybody Likes Pizza. And there's a pizza on the front cover. Go figure. On the back is a picture of my cat. His name is Peanut Butter Sandwich. <laughs> We call him peanut butter sandwich because he looks like a slice of white bread spoiled in peanut butter. And here he is, caught on camera, taking, without permission, a slice of pizza from my pizza box, proving that everybody, even cats, like pizza. <laughs> maybe, maybe I should get him some actual cat food. Maybe then he wouldn't try and eat my pizza. What do you think? Yeah. Or maybe I should call the pizza place and say, can I get a personal cat pan pizza? And they send me a pizza about this big. And I put some cat food topping on it. What do you think? Maybe like that? Alright, well I'm going to play for you guys the pizza song, but before I do, I would like to share with you a little piece of artwork that my friend William sent to me. This is the alien pizza. <laughs> How cool is that? And on the back, in his own handwriting, it says, even aliens like pizza. And, do you know the giant head? It says, giant head caused by eating radioactive pizza. <laughs> So don't eat the radioactive pizza. But when William sent this to me, I was so impressed, I took a picture of it and I put it on my website. If you would like to send me a really cool piece of artwork, all you gotta do is go to my website. All the information is there. You can send me a cool piece of artwork like this and I will take a picture of it and put it on my website. All right, the pizza song is called Everybody Likes Pizza. The chorus part's really simple. It just says, everybody likes pizza. So whenever you're feeling comfortable, just go ahead and join in. It goes like this. Everybody likes pizza. Everybody likes pizza. Everybody likes pizza. Everybody likes pizza. There you go. Everybody likes pizza. Everybody likes pizza. Everybody likes pizza. Everybody likes pizza. When I was just a young boy, on a Saturday night, we'd order in pizza. Call it family night. Hanging with the siblings, watching TV, eating cheese pizza, good memories for me. Hang on a second. You guys know what siblings are? Yes. What are siblings? Brothers and sisters. Did you know? Brothers and sisters. Siblings are brothers and sisters. How many of you guys have siblings? Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Okay, then you, then you have a sibling. Okay. Okay. Okay, you have siblings. Okay. Okay, then you have a sibling. Okay, then you have a sibling. One time I asked that question to a group of kids at a library and they said, Siblings, ooh, ooh, I know what that is. Isn't that something to eat? And I said, No, you may be tempted to eat your siblings occasionally. But you must resist the temptation because when you get older, you're really going to like them. And I should know because I have three brothers and three sisters. And when the pizza came to my house, you had to be ready. Plate in hand, elbows out, it's gone in 30 seconds. <laughs> then on Sunday morning, I get up around 10, turn on the oven, and have pizza again. Sing it with me. Everybody likes pizza. There you go. Everybody likes pizza. 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 You can get it at a restaurant or down at the store. Pick up the phone bell. Bring it right to your door. I want you to think about that for a second. You do not even have to get out of your bed or get out of your pajamas, or leave your house. All you have to do is pick up the phone, order a pizza, and they will bring
bring it to your door. Think about that. Yeah. Try doing that with some chicken nuggets. Get it with some toppings. Pepperoni or ham. I like them crusts. But you can have ham. I like the cheese pizza. Brought right to my door. Eat one slice of pizza. And you're sure to want more. Sing it with me. Everybody likes pizza. Everybody likes pizza. There you go. Everybody likes pizza. 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 So I got to wondering, just for wondering's sake, just how many pizzas in a day do they make? Anybody want to take a guess? How many pizzas are made in one day? How many do you think? A million? Okay. A hundred? Okay. One hundred? How many? One? Okay. How many do you think? No, no, with the hand up. How many do you think? Six? Okay. How many? 110? How many? 1,000. Okay, how many do you think? 1,010? Okay, 10,000? How many? It does depend on the day. It does depend on the day. That's the first time I said it. Maybe, well, let's pretend it's a Wednesday. And see how many you think are made on Wednesday. How many do you think? Anybody like 
onions on their piece? Okay. Let's see. Alright. If you are just like my cats, and you like cat food on your pizza, raise your hand. Yeah, doesn't matter where you go, there's always at least one. <laughs> Alright, if you like stinky socks on your pizza, raise your hand. Yeah, it's almost always the cat food people that like the stinky socks. You can call the pizza place and say, can I get a large cheese pizza with extra stinky socks, please? <laughs> and you know what they're going to say? They're going to say, you've been hanging around with Andy Mason, haven't you? Click. <laughs> this is usually the part of the program where somebody says, who's Andy Mason? <laughs> All right. I got to tell you guys another quick story. About two months ago, I was in a little country called Iceland. <laughs> Yeah, I was in Iceland. Oh. Mm -hmm. And in Iceland, we decided we wanted to get a pizza. So we went to a little place called Pizza King in Iceland, and we started looking at the menu, and we saw a word on the list of toppings that we had never seen before on a list of toppings. You know what that word was? Pizza! Surprisingly, it wasn't pizza. On the list of toppings, the word we saw was Banana. That's what I thought too. But then I did the only thing that I could do. I ordered a banana pizza. And you know what? It was really good. And if you don't believe me, you can go to my website and you can see pictures of me eating banana pizza in Iceland. All right. You guys want to know what the most delicious pizza topping ever is? The most delicious pizza topping ever in the history of pizza? Yeah. It's not banana. Although that's a very good topping, and I do recommend that you try it. No, the most delicious pizza topping ever in the history of pizza. Now, I don't know if you guys know this, but I'm from New Mexico. And in New Mexico, we love green chili on our pizza. And if you've never tried green chili on your pizza, you should try it because it's amazing. Alright, if you guys will sing it with me one more time, here we go. Everybody likes pizza. 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 Alright, now call me crazy. But, I know you guys can sing it louder than that. I know we're in the library and I know we're supposed to be quiet normally, but... I want you guys to sing it as loud as you can, okay? I've been singing this song for about, I don't know, nine and a half minutes. I'm not a bit tired. Or proud. You guys want pizza? Yeah! All right. You gotta sing loud, okay? And then talk to your parents after the show. <laughs> All right, are you ready? When it comes around again, I want you guys to sing it as loud as you possibly can. I want everybody in the Cheyenne Library to know that we are downstairs singing. Everybody likes pizza, okay? All right. Hang on, not yet. <laughs> We're gonna go together. When it comes around again, we're just waiting for it to come around. Here it comes. Sing it like you're hungry. Ready? 